Well, all right, we're back. I've got the final update to the settings for copper etching today and update to the uh, supplies I have been using to make this happen. Today we have a deeper bucket so everything can actually go down to the bottom so it's not just sitting in that murky water. And I have these two pieces of wood on top that allow me to pinch the wire wherever I want it and suspend it at whatever depth or further away from the one that's already in there. Another thing that I did do today was update the piece of steel on the negative side. That's nice clean solid and we have a larger text piece on this side I'm thinking it's about another 10 minutes and we're gonna check it we'll pull it out but I just wanted to give you guys the update so now you can see how this is working out it's a nice clean solution you can see it's already been turning blue so some stuff has been happening already we're at the same six volts as we were yesterday and once this is done I'll give you a quick update once I take it out and uh, we'll see the results and compare it to what happened yesterday all right so here's the final result of the first one. I had a couple blowouts on the mask. This was a test to see. If I don't heat the mask, this is what happens. And I did not scrub the debris out of the middle of this. I just left it. So it is going to be way darker. But I just wanted to show the difference of with the mask not heated, this is what happened. I got a couple pieces where it kind of got out of hand and uh, spread. So it's, again, it's, it's all right. It, it's not perfect. But today, what we just did is pretty much perfect. Um, I didn't leave it in quite as long and I did scrub it so it's not as dark in the middle but you can tell. Look at how clean those lines are. Look at how it's a nice hard edge. It's got some depth. It's smooth. It's pretty much mint. So I know what I've got to do if I want to get a finish like this every time now is heat the mask and that definitely helps any of that bleed out like you see on this side here. Just trying to give you a better view of the whole thing and let you see the edge that I'm seeing here. So I guess that's it for this. Thanks for coming along on the journey of learning. Six volts, less than an hour, and a warm mask. Copper. Please, thumbs up, comment, subscribe. Tell me what I've been doing wrong my entire life. Help me out. Let's learn and get better together. Until next time.